It's a gorgeous Tuesday in the Wiregrass. Lots of sunshine. The clouds stayed well to our east. Rainfall was well off the coast. Nothing to worry about today. A little bit of wind out there, and it was a little cooler than average, too. Temperatures much cooler than what we had yesterday as well. Current winds still blowing out of the north and northwest, 5 to 10 miles per hour for the most part. These winds, though, will go calm later on tonight, meaning a perfect recipe for a very chilly evening ahead. Warmer air to the west, 70s and 60s for folks in Texas and Louisiana, but 50s along the Gulf Coast states and to our north as well. Some really cold air in the Tennessee River Valley, even cold down in Florida, 54 in Tampa, not so much in Miami at 71 degrees, but a lot of folks getting in on some of the cooler air. And you see these numbers anywhere from 8, 9 to 15 degrees cooler than it was at this time yesterday, but we're going to flip that for tomorrow, I think we'll see warmer temperatures for tomorrow as uh, some warmer air in the mid levels comes in and also another front approaches from the north. The old front that we had well to our west or well to our east, I should say that area of low pressure now spinning off the Carolina coastline and we've got steady northerly and northwesterly winds bringing in that drier and cooler air, but only for one day as that low spins to the north and northeast. That means our winds will change direction, higher pressure will build in, and a more southerly flow builds in for tomorrow. But we'll stay clear for tonight, meaning a cold night and early morning for your Wednesday. How low can we go? I think middle 30s for most of us. The northern section of the viewing area could get down into the freezing territory. But everybody should see a decent chance for some frost early tomorrow as winds go calm. And we've got enough low-level moisture around where frost could be a possibility. So watch out for that and also bring your pets inside and cover up any sensitive vegetation you might have outside as well. That could be in danger for tomorrow morning. Wednesday afternoon, lots of sunshine once again. Cloud cover should be non-existent. We'll see a warm up, a nice warm up. I think a little warmer uh, on the future cast and what we'll see, I think 63s and 64s for tomorrow afternoon. Of course, we'll have the random spots that reach the upper 60s for your Wednesday afternoon, but a very nice middle of our work week by Wednesday night and into Thursday. Another cold front will be approaching, so expect chilly conditions for tomorrow morning, mild conditions for tomorrow afternoon. The cold front approaches by Wednesday night, pushes in by Thursday, and then cooler air takes over the wire grass on Thursday. And for the rest of the work week, by the end of the week on Friday, we're going to be talking about some pretty chilly stuff. And here you see the three day breakdown 26 on Friday morning and 48 is all we'll muster for a high on Friday, but at least we'll see a lot of sunshine. That's the one silver lining in all of this. And the weekend forecast is looking cold mm, as well. And we'll no, have details Nate, on that come on. in the five day coming up at six o'clock. Nate, come on what? now. We had such a nice weekend this last weekend. We I, know, did. I know you don't dictate this stuff, but it's still like, And it's gonna be on. completely opposite. All right, well, we'll make it through. We yes, always we will. do. We will trudge on. Trudge on. Thanks, Nate. You're welcome.